Come back in the kitchen again with Chef Ricardo Cooking Show. It's amazing to be in the kitchen giving your favorite recipes and ideas. I want to make you some real Jamaican brown stew chicken. I'm gonna do it the easiest way, the simplest way that you guys can make this one at home. Thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo Show. Got a lot more recipes, a lot more ideas, a lot more things will be coming. Stay tuned in in this recipe because I'm gonna make it from scratch to finish. I love you all and you know what? Subscribe is very important. Thank you so much for your comments, for your like, and for watching my video. Stay tuned. Nice and lovely. Welcome back, welcome back. First of all, I'm just gonna show you how to marinate your chicken and I'm gonna introduce you to my garlic crusher. If you want to get this garlic crusher, the link will be in the description box or you go to www.chefricardacooking.co.uk Look at this. This is how the garlic crusher works. Put in this right here. Get one cup of garlic and simple. Squeeze it in and put it in and just this. Look at this. See that juice coming out? That's exactly what we're talking about. So, we want to put the garlic first on the meat. You just use a spoon and just scrape it off. See that? Nothing is inside. The best garlic crusher in the world is this. If you want a good garlic crusher, look at this. Look at this, guys. Two cover garlic. Put another one. Then I use a rough about almost four cover of garlic. And the more garlic you put on the chicken, it's going to be the best. The garlic oh my god tell me tell me this is the best garlic crusher in the world I love it look at this look at that if you want to buy go to double double that Chef recorded cooking that call that you can. The link will be in the description box. Nice one. So, what we're going to do is best for you to use a gloves and marinate the chicken. But I want to rub up the garlic for the chicken first before I do anything. So, I'm putting on my gloves. Once you do that, put on the rest of the ingredients. When you wash your chicken, make sure you wash it with lemon juice. Some thyme. It's gonna cut up this thyme using my scissors. Some spring onion. You can use a knife if you want, but I just make life a little bit more easier sometimes. Yeah, so then also use a knife if you like. And a um, quarter of half of a white onion. about a pinch of browning not too much just like a tiny bit of browning coming to like white meat you like to see season power meat and all that thing there second thing pepper all right 
gonna put some all purpose season one two tablespoons of the all purpose season and this is the Jamaican Valley season I've been using very good season no salt perfect one two chicken spice Jamaican Valley season again Give her a little bit of trick. I have some chicken gravy. Let's put a tablespoon of the chicken gravy on it. Little bit of olive oil or vegetable oil. Then marinate it like this. See that? This is nice. So what we're gonna do? Put down this about three hours for it to soak. After three hours, then we're gonna show you how to cook it. Alright? Or you can put it down for 24 hours and cook it the next day. Alright guys? As you can see, look at that. Beautiful and nice. As you can see, all that brown stew chicken. Really lovely and nice.